A sixth grade teacher was fired after her superiors found out that she used to be a porn star. I'm gonna tell you all about it right now on IO. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Charlotte. Happy weekend. What are you guys doing? I'm actually putting the finishing touches on my latest YouTube video. Super excited to show you, but I'm only gonna make it live when I reach 2,000 subscribers. So post it down below for those who are interested. Would love it if you guys subscribed. All right, enough shameless self promotion. Let me introduce you to Risa Woodward, the 38 year old former porn star who taught at an all girls school called Blatch Sports. Springs in Texas. Around 20 years ago, she was the star of over a dozen girl on girl porn films. Some of the titles of the films included the following Luscious Lesbians, Little Miss Lesbian, and Naughty Nights 2. Her porn stage name was Robin Foster between 2001 to 2004. When she spoke to the morning news, Woodward said, I taught at a school that was all about empowerment for women. Someone implying that firing her based on her past was not in support of empowerment for women. She worked incredibly hard to get her master's degree and has worked in education for the last 15 years. Woodward alleges that she fought to get out of the porn industry and that she had no control of what she was doing. She claims that she was living with an older man who forced her to do these films because they were going through a difficult financial time. This isn't the first time a woman has been forced to join the adult film industry by a man she was seeing or living with. It's a pretty common and unfortunate thing. Some women just don't have it in them to say no. Personally, I don't know what happened to her or how this man forced her to get involved in adult films, but for most girls, there's always a point where one decides to do it. There's always a point where it's like, okay, yeah, I'm gonna take my clothes off for porn now. It's even a shame that girls on YouTube are saying that they'll do porn when they get a million subs. Maybe Lena the Plug or Zoe Berger have no plans to be teachers right now, but life changes. What I can say is, don't get naked for nobody on camera if you aren't prepared to deal with it down the line. We live in an age of technology. That stuff will never go away. It will be on the internet forever. How do you guys feel about this story? Do you think she should have been allowed to keep her job, or do you think that she should have thought of the consequences before? Before she decided to do porn. Woodward has done everything that she can to get her life back in order, and as it stands right now, she is fighting for her job back. But she's still on administrative leave until further investigation. Alrighty, it is comment time. Santi Gaming said, Thank you for making the news more interesting. I really don't like watching the news, so I go to you guys. That means a lot. The news sucks most of the time, but I'm glad some of you guys enjoy IO. Erica Stone said, Nice, I am so sharing this video. Thank you, IO. Love my fellow potato people, and your videos rock. Thank you, Erica. Please share our videos. It really helps us out to get the word out about IO. We want to make this channel the best it can be, and in order to get there, we need an amazing fan base. Tell all the potatoes you know about IO. The anonymous trader said, She keeps calling me a potato, and I like it. Oh, yeah? You like it? <laughs> Okay guys, that's all for now. Thanks for watching IO. If you want to keep watching, make sure you click one of these two videos floating right over here.